I found something that I think um, points to the rapture happening this year. I know that the uh, first mention in the Bible is extremely relevant um, of any word. I wonder where the first mention of the number 20 is found in the Bible. And so I looked it up and I found it in Genesis 18 verse 31. It says, and he said, Behold now, I have taken upon me to speak unto the Lord. Peradventure there shall be twenty found there. And he said, I will not destroy it for twenty's sake. The first mention of twenty in the Bible is found in uh, the days of Lot. I started thinking about the days of Noah and I thought, I bet the first mention of thirty is found in the days of Noah. Where is the first mention of the word thirty in the Bible? It's found in Genesis 6 verse 15. It says, And this is the fashion which thou shalt make it of. The length of the ark shall be 300 cubits, the breadth of it 50 cubits, and the height of it 30 cubits. So there you go. 2030 is found in the days of Lot and in the days of Noah. And the reason this is so significant is uh, because Jesus said, and as it was in the days of Noah, so shall it be also in the days of the Son of Man. They did eat, they drank, they married wives, they were given in marriage until the day that Noah entered into the ark, and the flood came and destroyed them all. Likewise also, as it was in the days of Lot, they did eat, they drank, they bought, they sold, they planted, they builded. But the same day that Lot went out of Sodom, it rained fire and brimstone from heaven and destroyed them all. Even thus shall it be in the day when the Son of Man is revealed. So the days of Lot and the days of Noah, 2030, subtract the 7, 2023. And something else I noticed about 2030, if you take out the zeros, you're left with 23. And 23 is this year. So I thought that was kind of cool. And here's another little bit for you. I don't know, you know, what you'll make of this, but I'll mention it anyway. 20 times 30 is 600. And the Bible says, and Noah was 600 years old when the flood of waters was upon the earth. So I thought that was interesting too. It looks like this year is going to be the year. We see that the conditions are right. We need to begin looking up. And Jesus told us, that when you begin to see these things come to pass, look up for your redemption, draw nigh. And what are these things? Rumors of wars are off the chart right now. We are at the edge of oblivion of a nuclear war right now. Every single sign we were told to look for is happening and is ramping up and is gaining in frequency and intensity. I believe we're seeing the birth pains and I believe we're getting raptured very soon. I think it's very, very soon. All the signs are making sense. If you separate the signs one at a time, you're not going to see it. You're going to say, ah, oh, there's always been wars and rumors of wars. All that you have to look at the convergence of the signs. You have to look at all the signs together and how they've happened together simultaneously worldwide. Join me on my other media platforms. The links are in the description area below this video. Thank you for watching. Please like, share, and subscribe.